The fossil record of snakes is pretty interesting. Uh, it shows us that not only did snakes have complete forelimbs and hind limbs, but it also shows us the order in which the limbs were lost. And if you look carefully at the tail end of this python, you can see the rudiments of his leg, this little black spot right next to his vent. Uh, you see a claw sticking out. Yeah, so the question of why snakes lost their limbs is interesting. The way that we've tackled the why uh, question is why did it happen genetically? So Francisca Leal, who's a PhD candidate in my lab, decided to tackle this question. So we started to look at the uh, genetic circuit that controls limb development, comparing it between a lizard that develops limbs and a python that doesn't develop limbs. And we identified uh, a break in the circuit in which an important gene, a gene called Sonic Hedgehog, it's actually named after the video game, uh, is, it's, and it's absolutely required for limb development, it only flickers on and then goes off in, in the python. Whereas in uh, a, a human or a mouse or a lizard or any other organism that you were to examine, that gene stays on and acts as the motor, driving limb development all the way down to the fingers and the toes. Uh, so drilling down into the genome, what we found was that there are three mutations that occur not in the sonic hedgehog gene itself, but in an enhancer, which is a switch that controls when the sonic hedgehog gene comes on and switches off. And these mutations uh, are responsible for very weak activity of the gene. It flickers on and it flickers off because the activators of that gene are not able to bind and switch on transcription. So this shows the uh, expression pattern of the sonic hedgehog gene in the leg bud of a, of a lizard. You can see that it's a very strong staining pattern and it stays on for a very long time as the uh, distal structures in the limb are being laid down, down to the toes. In pythons, it's a very different story. The gene flickers on in this very weak domain and then it's gone. Within 24 hours, there's no detectable uh, evidence of the sonic hedgehog gene. I think this is interesting for a number of reasons. Uh, humans have been interested in this bizarre path that snakes took uh, during evolution for a very long time. Uh, it's one of the strangest uh, uh, body plans that you find in, in vertebrates. And I think this lays a foundation for doing further comparative studies to look at how organs and structures are lost over evolutionary time.